another Arkansas voice is impressing millions on the big stage. Got that right. Stephen McMorrin grew up in Little Rock and is now the second Central Arkansas contestant on NBC's The Voice. Neil Zarang spoke with him today after a close call in an elimination round last night. So how's he feeling now? Kevin Donitz, Stephen says the whole thing has felt like a ride on the rocket ship to the moon, even though pursuing his dreams took him out of Little Rock. He's bringing everything he learned here to compete. Oh, the shine of a thousand spotlights. On his own and in a battle. Twice now, Stephen McMorrin has shown the world what his voice can do. But before everyone knew, it was Arkansas. I grew up in Little Rock singing. I would sing at church. I would sing. Sometimes it's cool. Stephen graduated from Little Rock Central High in 1999 with honors. He was an orchestra in a Christian students group where Teresa Siegel was a sponsor. There's a lot of good people, famous people that walk these halls. And I'm glad to add Stephen to that group. In high school, college, a move to Los Angeles, and eight years later, Nashville, Stephen was performing in different bands. But as his family grew, how often he performed shrunk. He began writing songs full time for artists like Tim McGraw and Celine Dion. His humbleness, you would not know all that he's done. When it came to auditioning for The Voice, though, Stephen said his publisher threatened him to do it. At that point, I really just decided to have a lot of fun with it. I mean, I love singing, so grab the mic, step up there and sing a song. Stephen, man, you sang the hell out of that thing, dude. With back-to-back -back close calls, Stephen is savoring every moment with his wife and sons. I hope that they see me chasing it, you know? I hope that inspires them to do the same. And he wants his hometown crowd to know he feels the love, and his heart is full. Keep watching, and thanks for, thanks for rooting for me. Stephen is on the same team as Andrew Igbokiti from Hot Springs this season, and he tells me they become good friends and enjoy talking everything Arkansas together. Niels Rang, Fox 16 News.